the latest RP treatments in 2022. RP contains a diverse group of symptoms, including night blindness, loss of central vision, and peripheral vision. Recent innovations in genomics have allowed us to identify the causative defects and to design treatments that target specific mechanisms of the disease. Here, we provide a comprehensive review of the latest RP treatments in 2022, including pretreatment for stem cell and gene therapies, stem active, stem cell based therapy for neuroprotection, gene therapy, microcurrent stimulation, OCU vision and AC stim, neurotropic and nerve growth factors injection, vascular shunt surgery, bionic eyes, etc. Pretreatment for stem cell and gene therapies, stem active is the best pretreatment and preparation for future gene and stem cell therapies. It will double guarantee the best treatment outcomes safely and naturally as it optimizes the microenvironment of the retina and includes anti-inflammatory, antioxidative, and anti-apoptosis components. Stem cell and genetic material can be injected into a certain zone in the eyes and eventually cure the disease, but without a healthy microenvironment. An inflamed surrounding could end in a complete failure of any therapy. Over 10 years of RP patients follow-up has shown that patients who supplement with stem active have had on average an annual decrease in the loss of retinal function by 20% as measured by ERG in comparison to those not taking stem active. It also helps maintain a healthy and balanced inner circumstance of the retina. Stem cell based therapy for neuroprotection. Mesenchymal stem cells were found to secrete nerve growth factors that normally support cell proliferation and differentiation. They also decrease apoptosis at the ischemic zone and provide neurotrophic factors. Stem cell therapy can potentially replace degenerate photoreceptors and retinal cells. When placed in the appropriate tissue, these stem cells not only survive, but differentiate into critical retinal cells and photoreceptors. However, the effect of stem cell therapy is not permanent. Patients have to repeat it regularly, depending on their vision loss speed. Further studies are needed to optimize techniques and make sure a permanent effect. Gene therapy. A variety of gene therapies are in different stages of clinical trials, including gene augmentation, gene editing, RNA modification and optogenetics. However, there are still a lot of obstacles and limitations. The first FDA approved gene therapy, which is known as Luxterna, is for people with LCA caused by mutations in the gene RPE65. The cost for one-time treatment is nearly 1 million US dollars. And it's still not known how long will the treatment benefits last. It's not affordable for most people with no insurance coverage. Microcurrent stimulation. Research showed that the specific electrical stimulation enhances the activity and function of the retinal cells, thereby reinforcing visual signaling along the optic nerve and restoring impaired vision. The lower frequency increases energy production in the retina, reverts the damaging retina, preserves visual acuity in the visual field. The higher frequency helps relax the retinal tissue, increase blood supply to the retina, stimulate and energize dormant optic cells. The microcurrent stimulation also attracts adult stem cells to help stimulate possible cell regeneration. Both OCU Vision and AC Stim are the similar home vision therapy devices. AC Stim has a unique regulator and processor that adjusts the frequency and power based on each individual's retinal tissue acceptance. Neurotrophic and nerve growth factors injection and nerve growth factors contain a large number of active factors that counteract the degeneration of photoreceptors. 
they also contain the essential protein for the self renewal of optic stem cells. During the treatment, retrobulbar injection is utilized to deliver auto serum as well as nerve growth factor to the retina and the damaged optic nerves. Vascular shunt surgery. It's a surgical procedure to increase blood and nutrients to the central retinal artery and short posterior ciliary artery. This procedure improves the optic nerve, retina and choroid nutrients. Although it's not a cure for RP, the effect of surgery is rapid and persistent. Bionic eyes. It's the only surgical implantable device currently available for RP patients who bear no light perception. It costs about 150,000 US dollars, excluding the cost of the implantation surgery and training to use the device. Unfortunately, people still cannot see any details. They can only regain some light perception and feel light or dark after implantation of the bionic eyes. If you are interested in the latest RP treatments, please review our website www.restorevisionherbs.com